Willkommen, bienvenue, and welcome back to King's Quest 1, Quest for the Throne, live with light. So I started up beam a little early. I think FTL is working. I think we've got 30 FPS. Should have FTL, should have 30 frames per second, should be good. I balanced things out pretty well with guacamole on Friday to the great expense of guacamole itself, but I think I've got a decent balance that should prevent the roboting, keep it in FTL, and go 30 frames per second. Uh, FTL, it's the faster than the light protocol that they use instead of RTMP that lets you have very low latency between you talking to me and me talking right back to you. So if you send a message in the chat, you'll see it come up on screen pretty darn quick. Nigh on instantaneous. It's not quite instantaneous, but nigh on. Um, but yeah, Pi Guy, I had a little trouble getting FTL to work at the beginning too, and then I refreshed three times, and it was fine. I don't know if you need to refresh three times. I don't know what sort of magical spell we need to cast, what goats we need to sacrifice, but yeah, refreshing should cross your fingers work. And if you're not certain, you can right click on the video and click on stats for raccoons. And that will bring up a fancy stat screen at the bottom, which should say FTL, low latency mode, and talk about packet loss, packet total, bandwidth, and whatnot. That way you can see whether or not you're actually in FTL or if it kicked you over to the other type. Roughly 10 seconds, well that, that means you're in the other type. That I don't have much control over. My uh, bit rate is about as low as I can manage, such that it doesn't impact people with relatively poor connections. But again, Beam has gone through some growing pains lately, so you're gonna have some minor issues now and then, because they got a lot of traffic from the Windows Creative Update. They got a lot of traffic from the app going on the Xbox. Mm -hmm. Hey, don't damn your mama. She's a lovely lady. But the fact that you have to go, that's fine. Have a good one, Nixius. If you can come back, you can. If you can't, you can't. We'll be back on Friday with uh, something. All right, Mages of Mistralia. Uh, yeah, so if Beam is a little wonky at the moment, it's a little wonky at the moment, uh, please let me know the moment I go robot, because I don't want to be all robot. Omega 88, late night as usual. Well, it's not late for me. If you look in the chat, it's only 6.30. But if you're in Europe, real late. <laughs> but let's get this game on the road. We need to beat this game to death. So, last time, Dragon Cheat Goats. Oh, right. We got a violin from this guy because we brought him an infinite bowl of soup. Had to restart the YouTube app. Oh, no. Hello, though. Okay. So, we have a violin, it's not entirely clear what to do with it. Is there no game audio? There generally isn't, but... Oh, let's find out. So how are the levels? I know it's probably a little low, but I'd much rather it be a little low than <laughs> what happened in my Dead Cells episode. So what do y'all think? Good? Bad? Need to be higher? Need to be lower? Can you not hear it at all? It's a violin! 
A lot low? Okay. I can turn that up. There is no problem turning it up. Let's click back in. Let's try it again. How is it this time? It should be quite a bit louder. And that should be a good level for most of the things in the game. No music lovers. What a waste. Okay. So. Let's walk around and think about what we've got access to. We've got a big old pond that we don't really know what to do with. We've got one very deep pond that we don't have anything to help us swim in. We've got a pond where leprechauns make dandelion tea. So I'm thinking we might come across some leprechauns at some point, which is not going to be good because they'll probably kill us. So we need to find something to protect us from leprechauns. So what would protect you from a leprechaun? Uh, other things we need to think about. How do we get to that one mushroom in that one place? Curly fries? Why would curly fries protect you from a leprechaun? So, I'm working on making my way to the mushroom. Keep an eye out for anything strange on the way. Why do leprechauns hate curly fries? Leprechauns are people, too. People like curly fries. Ooh, this looks weird. And that's a bird. Okay, just a uh, countless bolt. Okay, so this mushroom. We need to get this mushroom. So we need to get across the river. How do we get across the river? I mean, this seems like a long way for a board. It's possible we need to get the axe and chop down a tree somewhere else and do something. But we can't approach it from the north. We tried approaching it from the east, and it just didn't want to work. So, let's keep looking. Yeah, I don't know why sometimes it lets people do FTL and sometimes not. Um, at the moment, seems you're just going to have to live with the current state of things. This place seems suspicious because there's nothing going on. There's just rocks. Big ol' log. Hmm. Take log. Move log. Fine. We'll save. Oh no, we're at our limit. Yeah, we met the sorcerer there, but you can meet. Oh, geez. Run away. You can meet all sorts of vile creatures here. Like an ogre. Okay. Is there anything here? I mean, we've got weird cracks in the rock, but not much else. Yeah, Shrek indeed. Um, 
I'm also curious about the birds, because the birds happen in certain places, but not others. Hey there, Rowan Dragon 2. Gonna catch up? Enjoy. We have done hardly anything. Pine trees, but not much else. Hmm. And here we are with the nuts again. We get your references. People have seen the birds, or at least have heard of the birds. Sorcerer. Goodbye. Okay, fine. I won't go through there. And this place probably has the witch. Oh, an ogre. Great. Okay, here's a small hole. I'm thinking the mushroom has something to do with this small hole. But we can't really do anything with it. Uh, what else can we do in this menu? We can duck and we can jump. Too busy ducking to jump. Let's get our calisthenics in. Hmm. Okay, so what else are we considering? We need to find a patch of earth to plant the beans in. We need to find something to do with a pebble. Hmm. None of this looks like fertile ground, really. I mean, maybe we can plant it behind the castle. What is that on that rock? Probably just stray pixels, apparently. It's <laughs> so much sharper than the King's Quest one you played on the Sega Master System. Um, yeah, this is actually the official re-release that Sierra did around the time they put out King's Quest 4, I think. Because um, this, this is very much the style of King's Quest 4. Uh, they cleaned up the art a lot. There was an unofficial re-release with even more beautiful art later, but it was it was not official. So I don't know what, if anything, they changed about the game itself. Okay, let's do another save. We haven't done anything interesting, so we can replace the one we've got. Throw... Pebble at bird. That had no effect. Yell at bird. Mm. Shake tree. Hit tree. Hmm. Nothing seems to work with that. And we're back here again. Is it a brood with only two offspring? Sure, why not?
<laughs> what about the squirrel? What about the squirrel? What can we do with the squirrel? We've tried a lot of things with the squirrel. Oh, look at that. Look at that right there. That's a four-leaf clover right there. Think we could use some luck, don't you think? Oh, it even flashed at us. Yay, we have a clover. Certainly hope it doesn't rot. Still need a place to plant the beans. Hmm. Yeah, if you have an egg and it hasn't started smelling clover, it'll be fine. Probably. Plant beans. But, but soil. Okay, we're on a hunt for special soil. Where have we been that may or may not have special soil? Hope can find someone playing Kinks West 1, been watching 4 and 5, it's such a classic. Well, I'm glad I could provide for you. We're probably about halfway through according to the score. It might be slightly more than that. And I didn't play this one when I was younger. So it's about as blind as you're going to get for a game this old. Well... How about we just try to plant it everywhere? And eventually, it'll say we're not close enough. Oh, small door. Goodbye. Man, this place is dangerous. Oh man, you missed out. Bust out that crap paper. Oh, sorcerer's gonna get me. Oh, he got me. And now we get to wait. Who's gonna show up to murder us? It's a short range spell. He hasn't learned projectile yet. He can only do hand based spells. So not a very good sorcerer. Still a better sorcerer than us, though. Perhaps there's better soil in the scary forest. See if we can make it across without dying. Can you even do anything with jumping and ducking? Also, except my duck. Um, I'm sure we'll be able to do something eventually. Maybe. The time for a witch? Oh, an ogre. Okay, so this is where the leprechauns make their wine. Uh, let's save again. We still haven't done anything interesting. If I ever go into a supermarket and just yell except my duck? Probably not. Does not seem like the sort of thing I would do. Oh, right. There was something I wanted to do here. Actually, there were a couple of things I wanted to do. Eat door. 
Awesome. Taste liquid. Um, what's it called? Drink goop. Open cell. Hmm. Taste goop. Uh, actually, let's take goop. Really? We won't? Oh, she's asking for it. Oh, she saw me. Rats, she's cast some spell on you to keep you from escaping. The witch remarks, oh, how nice of you to come for dinner. <laughs> You over carefully, then states, You're a little too scrawny for my appetite. I think you're going to make a lovely dessert. The witch has turned me into a gingerbread man. Or is that a graham cracker? <laughs> Okay, so now we desperately need to push the witch into that pot. Okay, so let's save it right... Oh, she's here. <laughs> okay, so let's save it. I wonder how I can trigger her to not be home. Yeah, by the time I get outside, she has lost all interest. Oh, there's, well, no, because the smoke will be there regardless. She's going to leave it on. Okay, fine. Uh, okay, so... Oh, we didn't actually eat any of her house on this save file. Eat house. As we begin to eat the house, a squeaky voice from somewhere... It says, nibble, nibble, little mouse. Who is nibbling at my house? Yay, points. She didn't say that last time. No, I'm not eating the children. Yeah, because she wasn't there, so she... Uh... She didn't notice last time. So it seems that might be a way of telling whether or not she's home. Okay, so we've got a snack. What do we do about the snack? Not much of anything, really. There's the rock with the hole in it. Gonna try to get FTL back? Okay. Good luck.
Plant beans. This looks like a great place. Hey, it worked! <clears throat> Plant the magical beans in the fertile soil. Suddenly, something incredible begins to happen. Musically, but not visually. <clears throat> okay. <clears throat> it's finally starting to do something. Kaboom! 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 I'll cut up beam time! One second delay. Nice. So. <clears throat> Was it me actually going robot or was my voice just cracking? Everything was going robo? Yeah, my uh, copy of the stream has gone away, so... Let me take a look. Okay, so we're back. We're good. We're FTL. Get back in the game. Let's save. All right, it does weird things when I click away. Okay. We're back. Okay. F5. Let's save over our first save. With... Meantime! Man, why is it gonna go all robo again? Well, that was weird. Yeah, most of the screen is black. I, I am well aware of that. Um, but it's clearly not a temperature issue. But I did change the thread priority again, so that might be part of it. I don't know if I can change that while we're running. We can. Okay. And now we paint the screen back into existence. Oh, man. That was weird. Okay, so if we uh, move and leave and come back... There we go. Yeah, uh, it's a keyframe sort of thing. It, it updates little by little, so it doesn't have to redraw the whole screen every time. It's a brilliant thing to do. It just... Mm. Okay, so we saved it. Hopefully we're not robot -y anymore. And now I'm going to climb this vine. Uh, beanstalk, really. Oh, the booster pack broke all the character mods? Um, all of them? Or is it just because we need to update all of the files in the resources? Because every time they add items, every time they add... Oh, uh, we're dead. <laughs> but I am trying to find all the ways you can die, and that one, well, needed to happen. Looks like you had a bad fall this spring. <laughs> Love it. Robo. Robo, robo, robo. It's 
So not a heat thing, not a thread priority thing. Could be an internet thing. Game music while talking seems to cause robo voice. That is weird. Super weird. Yeah, I'm going to go with super weird on that one. Okay, let's try to climb it again, this time in slow motion. Yeah, it's not on your end, but if there's a connection interruption between us where what I send doesn't go out properly, it could still be a, a connection problem from me to Beam. Going to do a something else since you don't really like it? Enjoy, Pie Guy. Thanks for stopping by. Log says player ID out of bounds after beating it lives or higher. Oh. Yeah, the trouble is with... Um... Okay, apparently that was too high. Apparently I just need to keep my hands on the vine. I was trying to keep my main body on the vine, but okay. Mm -hmm. Whatever it thinks, it's the way it should go. I'm good at it. I'll try. We'll, we'll see. <laughs> Get good, mate. Yeah. That, that's really what needs to happen. Okay, so... Really? That... That's just too high? Like, this is a weird thing to even have in the game, but... It's better than the staircases in number four. Staircases in number four are atrocious. Like, going up a st spiral staircase in the Perils of Rosella? Okay, so it appears that his hands are the only part that matter. Welcome back, real Fusha. Yeah, new death died on the right that time. <clears throat> <clears throat> oh, it's fantastic you're playing through it too. It's a really fun game. We made it! Ish. <laughs> You played the No Dead End remake version? That's okay. Ooh. Yeah, maybe it will make a deeper hole. It'll be hard to see it being deeper, though. Can you imagine trying to do this part, like, as a speed run, like somebody who just gets really good at climbing the vine.
Welcome to the top. F5! <laughs> Up top. Okay, so that was not the way to go. <laughs> uh... Where did I even get the beans from? Uh, Rumble Stiltskin. I'm not entirely certain where is safe to walk. Oh, we appear to have some land. Oh, the gnome gave you a different thing in the remake. What'd he give you? Okay, we have found a forest. Why do the trees have holes in them? Oh, right, wrong window. Key. Interesting. Yeah, I, I, I guessed his name. Best be careful where you are. Uh, I believe that was the spelling, yes. That tree looks like it has a face. Moving right along, moving right along. Oh, let's go up. Oh, hello. Uh, goodbye. So I thought it was going to be, but it's different in the remake, which I didn't like at all. Aw. That's weird. Astro Penguin! Password security on beam is real type. Yeah, it's pretty tight. Oh, there's a cave. Giant's still trying to kill me. Let's see if we enter from the left. Same hint, but his name is Murph Gorgovokfi? Mr. Gorg. Yeah, that's weird. Did they give you an extra clue somewhere else? Oh, typing with a reversed alphabet. I see. Oh, right, we do need to die from him, so we'll save up top again. Let's see what he does. Talk to giant. Play fiddle. Oh, he's not a music lover. Oh. Crunch. 
Okay, so he doesn't want to talk. The giant did a smashing job of defeating you. <laughs> Love it. Okay, uh, let's see. I have an idea. I don't know if I can pull it off, though. Come and get me! He's so slow. I can kite him like nobody's business. You can't catch me, Mr. Giant. Yeah, I don't want to kill him. Be honest, I just want to listen to the music. <laughs> no, I got the mirror from the dragon. Unless you mean the game, then yes. Yes, I have the mirror. This is on the dragon cheat save, yes. Because it looks like he's carrying the chest. John, he's getting tired of looking for you. Seems like he may be getting ready to take a nap. Hey, stop changing your pathfinding just because you're taking a nap. Good job, the huge giant tucked it out from stomping around has fallen fast asleep. Here I was, just wanting to listen to the music. Take chest. <laughs> Can't believe that worked. Uh, when Light and Abdu plays Dark Souls, he'll just try staying live in the long, the longest bit boss fights in it. I keep trying, which are the only places with music. Oh yeah, I I will totally do that. Never seen this game reminds you of Scribble Knots in the sense you have lots of freedom in how you execute goals. You have a bit of freedom. You don't have that much because it is an old game. Okay, and let's get out of here. Because you have a few options in certain situations. Uh, how do I get rid of the dragon? Um, I actually have an idea on how I would want to do that in the future. Um... But the way I did it on this save was I used the Fairy Godmother's protective spell. And it fired fire at me and it bounced off. And he was like, oh. Um, I also killed him with the dagger once. But I didn't like that, so I went back and tried it again. I have an idea. If we finish with enough time, I want to try something else. Um, to peacefully defeat the dragon. Uh, Chester. Okay, into the cave. Hopefully, this takes us back down. And hopefully, we don't need a lantern. Oh no. Why do you do this to me, game? Oh, right. Save. And jump. Whee! Whoops! Oh. These are so much worse than curly fries. Curly fries are fantastic. This is terrible. T R B L terrible. Coming through on the other side? Oh, thank goodness. This 
six screens like this. Certainly hope you know where you're going, uh, Graham. Oh, great. Actually, we're going to make several save files for this. Well, we're going to make two. One at the beginning and one at the end. Have I been here before? Um, I've been in a mountain that looks like this, but I haven't been on the curly fries yet. Yeah, that's not a lower level, that's that's a cross. Like, it's towards the screen quite a bit. Like, if anything, that first one was a lower level. Oh, and I fell. Where's the curly fries thing from? Um, so, I asked at the beginning of the stream what we could use to protect ourselves from leprechauns. And Sugar suggested we use curly fries. Because apparently leprechauns hate curly fries. Because they are evil, evil thing. Well, people. I mean, curly fries are awesome. Apparently leprechauns are evil and consequently do not enjoy curly fries. And I do not enjoy that the diagonal movement is twice as fast as the cardinal directions, and I also do not approve of that hidden fall. Like, I, I do not approve. Yeah, that I deserved. <laughs> Just walk to the right. Don't have to do anything. Apparently I cannot be trusted to walk on the curly fries, so we need to save. But yes, they didn't want to do the trigonometry to make the diagonal movement comparable to the others. So, yeah. What? Okay. And it doesn't help that you can't hold the directions. You press the direction. If you hold it, you get a stuttering movement like this. There we go. Is there a mod that gives multi-directional rolling in Dark Souls PTD? Because right now it's only the four way. I can't help you with that. If anyone was going to know the answer to that one, I would have expected it to be you. I think I can handle this one. But the next one's gonna be trouble. Oh man, I fell. They're all about the lore, not the modding. That's understandable. No, no, no. And before you say while well, wobbling, I don't think it'll let me, actually. OK. 
Okay, this part I think we're good. Whew. Okay, I think we're saved by the mountain at this part. Can't see because of my overlay. Is it safe? It's safe. Whew. If I were in the situation, I would lower center of mass and walk slowly on all fours to be way more easily with less pressure spots, be able to react at all times. Yeah, I, I imagine if you were a normal human in this situation, you wouldn't have a problem. Door just opened. Okay. Let's call that one magic door just in case we need to go back in. Yeah, just don't step into the abyss. It, it, it's really quite simple as a human. Okay, so, we've got the chest. Open chest. Dazzled by a countless supply of gold coins filling for the magic chest. You quickly close it. Look in chest. Take coins. That, those are the ones I want to take. Okay, fine. So, we have two of the three treasures. We still need to get the shield, which would probably be really useful for getting the shield. <laughs> How heavy is the chest? Likely not heavy at all, because if it's filled with infinite coins, it likely is just a portal to another dimension, and that other dimension can deal with how heavy that much gold is. Um, so, now we know where this door goes. We still need the mushroom to deal with the tiny hole. Um, I don't think we have anything in our inventory except for the fiddle that we don't know what to do with. Uh, dagger chest, carrot, note, four leaf clover, pebbles, pouch, cheese, magic mirror, gold, egg, fiddle, and walnut. Hmm. Well, how much it's worth doesn't necessarily indicate how much it weighs, because... Gold itself is heavy, regardless of its value. Okay, so we need to find a way to get to that mushroom. We also need to see if we can push that witch into the bubbling brew. I wonder if I can pay off the monsters that come to kill me. I've got infinite money now. Sweet house. She's in there. Give coins to which? Really? Keep it to myself? Ha. Ah. Hello, creepy tree. You gonna do anything?
punch tree. Fine. Hmm. So how are we going to get that mushroom? Why do you keep hitting caps lock? And this is the one that goes to the other side of the dragon, right? Yeah, that's the one that goes to the dragon. We don't need to deal with that. Oh, bird. Okay. Let's check out Stiltskin's area. We might have missed something. Decoy pedal? What's a decoy pedal? Do I have the invisibility ring? I didn't know there was an invisibility ring. Hmm. Because this is the part that's really annoying, because you should be able to come up here and just go to the west, and that's where the mushroom is. But... can't actually make it. And why would you have a fake pedal? Yeah, you know, I've heard of dead pedaling, but that's a whole other thing. Yeah, badger, badger, indeed. That's what we need. We need some badgers up in here. So, yeah, it, we can't go south from here to get to it. We can't approach it from the east. Caps Lock is not as useless as a decoy pedal. Because sometimes you do want to type in all caps. Not in polite company, but there are times... Yeah, but that gets exhausting for your pinky after a couple thousand characters. Can we whistle? Apparently not. No, like you hold it down with your pinky, but you're typing all the other ones and you're still holding it down and stress on things. I'm going to play the fiddle for the mushroom. I'm just going to keep playing it until somebody likes it. Give coins to mushroom. It's a little far away for that. Beat the game and never figured out a use for the fiddle. That's pretty interesting. Okay, 
Okay, so we got a whole lot of nothing going on. Play for the dwarf? Possibly. Pride the river to stop flowing. I mean, this, this looks suspicious, but it's nothing. I'm going to play for the squirrel. Oops. Play. Fiddle. You enjoy it, don't you, squirrel? Apparently he doesn't. Oops, didn't mean to go down, but that's fine. This is also suspicious. Come on, rat, come out of that hole. No music lovers. Maybe the witch is a music lover. Are you a music lover, <laughs> Snick? Uh, Twitch subs, actually, you have to refresh and hit share for it to actually get to them. Like, it'll kind of come up in the chat, but not seriously until you, uh, until you do the refresh and share. Is she home? Ah, she's not home. Saving. Push it. I don't understand why anyone would have a high lift distance for this mouse seems like a nuisance. Yeah, but one person's nuisance is someone else's convenience. Someone tasty in her house. Uh, I'm pretty sure I'm Claw. Yeah, definitely Claw. Huh. I wonder why she could... Oh, uh, it's probably going to be just another one of those really close, narrow walk properly sorts of things. And it might be that I was walking too fast. Game might have a mechanic like that. I hope it doesn't, but it might. Weird. I got closer that time. 
Can I sneak via command? Maybe. I already tried giving the witch coins. It told me to keep them to myself. Oh, give the witch to the coins. That could be interesting. Come on, get in the room. Uh, cause the note was here. Like, there's nothing else really going on. So we're gonna save it when she gets in here. Phase two. Push. Which? Brilliant! With a mighty shove, you courageously push the wicked witch into the pot. Her wild screams are suddenly cut off as she melts away into the oily green slime in the pot. Congratulations! And we got points! Big Tori. Taste. Goop. Drink. Goop. Wonder if there's a way to not kill the witch? Um, maybe? Uh, there might be a way to... Um, there might be a way to get some points like that without killing her, but... I don't know what it is. Uh, okay, so we're still on the hunt for a way to get to that mushroom. Did I read those same names, right? Were you trying to feed the goat to the dragon? Did it work? Uh, no. Um, I named things fairly randomly. Um... Very rarely do I make it thematic, but I started doing that for this stream for no particular reason. Because the axe is stuck. Is there any way to unstick the axe? Do we have anything that could be useful for that? Not really. No matter what I do. Yeah, don't use the oil can. That's a great way to get yourself sliced in half. And we're back to the snack again. Okay, beanstalk. Lake. Go for a swim. I would use the axe if it would let me take it, but it won't. That's some really annoying sounds. We already found the pouch in that. Yeah, can climb beanstalk like a pro, but can't lift an axe out of a log. The axe is sucking the stump, just take the stump. Pretty sure I tried that too. So 
we got some birds that we don't know what to do with. Oh, I have an idea. Give egg to bird. Okay, fine. You don't want to. You don't have to. I don't want to go swimming again. <laughs> You're going to axe! It is possible that the axe is a mercenary and just wants to get paid. Anything that'll help me breathe. Maybe the birds are magpies? Hmm. Put pouch on head. Put pouch on head. Put chest on head. <laughs> Give coins to water. Oh, we should toss some coins in the well. <clears throat> okay, so those were the clovers. We got the clovers. place looks a little weird. Get anything useful out of the stupid chest in the well? Nope. There's the pretty flower. Bird. No way in there. Save just in case. Okay, so we're in here. Dive, dive, dive. Strong currents under the calm surface would be dangerous to dive. Okay, can't get through the rocks. Drink water. No safe place. Yeah, build a coin bridge, that would be... That would be a much better plan than what we're doing so far. And I'm sure it's going to be perfectly obvious once we figure it out. <clears throat> Most of this stuff has been pretty obvious once we got it running, but... I have not seen anything particularly useful. So we've been up here to get the egg. We've 
Been in there. It's different from what it was in here game, at least. Well, that's interesting. <laughs> Those coins are actually pyrite. Uh, it's not going to make too much of a difference, really. Oh, the wolf might get us. Yay, no wolf. I really do not want to climb that, uh, either of those things again, really. Too much of a spoiler that I missed something up there? I probably did miss something up there. I'm going to go back up there pretty soon. Because clearly I've missed something. Yeah, I'm going to try the, the violin once we encounter another random who's a what's it. Um, <laughs> never figured out how to use that something, though. Hmm. Oh, it would be good just to have. What do I think of Mountain Blade 2 Warband? Never played it. Don't know anything about it. Robo, Robo, Robo. Oh, oh it's Robo on Twitch as well. Fascinating. Really? Too busy right now? What a world. Jump! That's the wrong button. Jump! Jump! You can do it! You can totally make it! Oh, how are you doing that? Um, F7. Not F7. F6. I can also duck. Except my duck. I don't know what good it does, but you can do it. Your remake of the game has that advanced functionality. We're running, running, run, running, 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 running. Throw coins in well. Okay, um, I think it might be time to climb back up top. Once I remember where that is. Problem is I work by color and not everywhere actually lines up. It's 
So this is the way to the witch's place. Kind of. Beanstalk! Time to save. Up again. And we'll think about how to get the mushroom while we're up there. So, does anybody who hasn't played the game have an idea? Really? Okay, apparently I'm not a master of vine climbing yet. Oh geez, it was still super fast. Why was it still super fast? I thought you said you beat it, though. I could ask the woodsman for the axe. Went too high. Welcome back. And yes, we're doing this again. <laughs> Climb. Can I just say vine? I can. Good. being too careful. Just gotta go for it. Maybe if you type autopilot, it'll climb itself. Let's try it. Nope. <clears throat> no. There we go. Okay, so now we're gonna take a good look around. What a beautiful sight. The clouds stretch in every direction beyond you. Near the beanstalk, you even seem thick enough to stand on. Okay, so. See if we can... Nope, can't go to the left. So we're going to the right again. So we need to keep an eye out for something that may or may not be valuable.
<clears throat> what did you miss? I don't know. I have been looking around for a way to get to that mushroom. Doesn't seem to be working. Thanks for the follow, Coconut81. If you have any ideas, feel free to let us know. Unless you've played the game before, and then keep them to yourself. While he's sleeping, we'll take a look at some things. And while since you played though, eh, that's fine. Because we got it on pretty good authority that we missed something up here. And that seems relatively likely because we didn't really look a lot of places. <laughs> Did he look up yet? No, I actually haven't. There's a hole at the bottom of one of the trees. Uh, that looks like a hole. Look in hole. I don't know which hole I'm looking at. <laughs> Look in hole with monocle. Slingshot. Well, that would have been handy if we wanted to murder the giant. Hawkins, welcome back. Examine slingshot with monocle. <laughs> give coins to hole, give coins to tree. Uh, yeah, so we probably could have David and Goliath this thing. And shot him with the sling. Because we have pebbles. How am I doing? Doing all right. We still don't know how to get the mushroom. And now we have to go back through curly fries. <sighs> Unless we can climb back down the vine. I think I might rather go down the vine. Than go down curly fries again. I just don't know if I can get back to the vine without falling to my doom. <laughs> One long nap. He is a giant. Giants need their beauty sleep. Uh, we should probably go back to normal speed now. Yeah, might be able to slingshot the encounters. Really doesn't feel like it should be on the uh, clouds. Climb vine. Easier, right? <laughs> yeah, that was that was not the plan. Oh, and we fall the whole way. Crunch. Still think this is gonna be easier though. Ah, 
Ah, that was no good. Felt it the moment I did it. The pain crunch. I just wish it said a different thing if you died that way enough. Just have to remember, hands. Hands, not body. So much easier. That was so much easier than going down curly fries again. Whew. Okay. Home sweet dirt. Okay, and now we're back in the same situation we were in before. Does it give you a secret message or read the note too many times in this game too? Possibly. Robo, 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 robo. <clears throat> I wonder if it's when I get too far away from the mic. And it thinks my voice is noise. Nope. No little bonus message. Oh, jeez. Whoa, 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 whoa. 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 What was that? It was there, and then it was gone. Giant bird thing. Hello, giant bird thing. Hello, giant bird thing. Giant bird thing. Hello, hello. Come back, bird. Oh, whistle, or fiddle. Fiddle could be good. Did walk past its nest? That's not a condor nest. It's a tiny little bird. Okay, we're gonna walk around. That bird's gonna come back. Come back, bird. Hello. Play fiddle. Really? Give egg to bird. Um. No, no, scary bird, scary bird. Grab him! We grabbed him! Hands in the air! Why are you doing this, Cram? You're a fool, Cram! You're going to fall to your doom! You can't handle a beanstalk! How are you going to handle an eagle or a condor or whatever bird this is? Can't be good for his tiny bird feet! Dead. We should be dead. Okay, so we're not dead. We are near a gaping hole in the ground. And we're gonna save. Uh, we're gonna replace this one. Sabaka! You can see Roger Wilco in that nest over there. Oh. 
Uh, mad ups. Okay, we are not jumping in the hole. Uh, okay. Geography. Where does it look like we are? Oh, it's mushroom territory! Mushroom, mushroom. Mushroom! Take mushroom. Yay! Okay, saving. <laughs> Should have given it the pyrite coins. Yeah, maybe. Uh, oh, apparently we can't do anything in this corner. Okay, so we're going to eat the mushroom because popular demand. We are a tiny gram. And we could do literally nothing. So we are going to reload. Okay, jumping in the hole. Let's uh, right-click on it first. Faint green glow, other side of the tiny hole. Tiny hole. Okay, climb into hole. Really? I feel like I'm pretty close. Whee! Crunch. This is not good for your face, Graham. Not good for your face. Yeah, midday. All day long. Creepy cave. Let's go to the south. Hello, Torch. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, totally having a concussion. Can't trust anything you see. Oh. Hello, giant rat. It's a good thing we brought some cheese. Oh, we should probably save first, in case we're not supposed to give him cheese. And we're gonna call this one Splinter. I'm so getting bitten. Actually, we saved it, so let's just go talk to him. Rabies! Don't do it! It's a trap! Rats! This one was... Uh, this was one shady character you shouldn't have tangled with. Yeah, that was really quite lame. Give cheese to rat. Cheese? Oh yeah, now that you mention it, I guess I am kind of hungry. Rat drools at the sight of the cheese, snatches it from your hand. Might want to count your fingers. 
way of taming it was way too cheesy. And apparently it was magic cheese that teleported the rat away. What? <laughs> what? Magic cheese. Count fingers. Amazingly enough, you still have all your fingers. <laughs> oh, I love that they included that. And I'm glad the door just opened. I didn't have to tell it to. Um... Hello. Um. With a genuine four-leaf clover in your possession, the leprechauns fear and respect you. Rather than risk offending you, they decide to leave you entirely alone. Okay. Oh, sorry about the robo voice. I'm gonna restore magic cheese. I want to try to play the fiddle. Wonderful job! Leprechauns find fiddle music irresistible! The moment they hear the music, they begin dancing a frenzied jig! Finally, swept away by the snapping music, the leprechaun guards poof right out of the room. Oh, sorry about the singing. I always forget that there's a lag because of my uh, audio processing. Wow. And call that one cat gut. Yeah, there are multiple ways of doing things. So if you missed the four leaf clover, you might have found the fiddle. If you missed the fiddle, you might find the four way clover. It's all sorts of ways you might be able to get things done. Overhearing the film music you played in the hallway, the leprechauns have begun to dance. As they do, they pop away in a fit of merrymaking. this Gog? Uh, no, I actually got it from myabandonware.com. So it's actual DOS playing through DOSBox. Would the coins work? I don't know, they might. I mean, this is certainly not the speedrunner strat. My goodness, they take forever to get away. Oh, but he left his scepter behind. Hey, we can finally move. Oh, and the shield, sure, but... Uh, actually, yeah, let's take the shield first. Take the Leprechaun King's Jeweled Scepter, because, yeah, why not? Well, let's follow where the king went. Oh, yeah. Tiny little doorway out into that rock with a hole in it. Let's do this one. I wonder how we're gonna get through there. Oh, right, we should look at the scepter.
I love that they can let me spell it wrong. Now have all three of Daventry's lost treasures. Now those don't waste any time. Bring the treasures straight back to King Edward before it's too late. All right, look at shield. Salmon shield? Really? X mine again? Okay. Anything else you want me to try before we go back? Maybe drink coins? Eat coins? Just the thought of eating that would make Braver Knights lose their appetites. Use shield. Oh, I know what I want to do. Yeah, scepter can be spelled wrong, but not examine. I wanted to I wanted to find something that I could use the shield against shield like biscuits. We are not Captain America. Really? Can't go that way? <laughs> Throw coins at Captain America. Okay, so that's the way back to the castle. I don't want to go there yet. The shield makes you immortal. You should be able to breathe on water with it. That's kind of true. which oops apparently my attempt at cliff diving was a smashing failure uh the beans are annoying to get to but yeah Still died, cheap Chinese magic shield. This place should be sufficiently creepy. No, I don't want to deal with the dwarf. I want anyone else. A wolf, an ogre, something. Yeah, I suppose I should save.
sorcerer. Brilliant. Really? Still? What good is having a shield if it doesn't reflect magic? to equip the shield? Ugh. I hate the dwarf. Okay, how did we get to that really deep lake? I know how to get to the castle. I want to get to the really deep lake. Unless you mean north to get to the really deep lake. Feels like it should be over here. one of the lakes, but this is not the lake I want. And here we are here again. Cute little elf? What's with the elf? Talk to elf. my own Instagram I think you might enjoy this little trinket but just a wee bit of time it has power to make you invisible may it give you as much entertainment as ye has given me this day going behind the tree with the elf cute with that the elf vanishes okay not what I was aiming for but Okay. We are even richer now. I am so bad with this map. <laughs> Let's see. Yeah, every screen is the one I want. Because this is to the cliffs. So clearly there's something wrong with my intuition.
Whoa, that was weird. We haven't seen that wolf for a while either. Okay, so here's the well. There's the goat. It's near the goat. I remember because I tried taking the goat past it and it caused trouble. Hey, there it is. Lame. <clears throat> okay, so let's go win the game and then test out my dragon hypothesis. <laughs> Put you on head. Guards are gone. Open port Cullis. That's odd. Why aren't the guards at their posts? More curious still, the courtyard is deserted. This area is usually filled with the ladies and lords of the castle. Highly unusual. You begin to feel deeply disturbed as if it's not right within the castle. And faintly hear a commotion in the king's chamber to the west. There's nothing to be done. Our king's melancholy is too much for his heart to bear. Perhaps if Sir Graham had returned with the three lost treasures of Daventry. Gasp! It's Sir Graham Cracker! He's returned! Find the treasures! Shh. Listen. Your Highness, I am at your service. Did you succeed in your quest? I did, Your Majesty. Here, as commanded. The magic mirror. The magic sheet and the magic chest. Kaplonk. I am afraid it is a little too late for me. As you have done superbly, my knight, as I promised, the kingdom is yours. I know you will serve her. The king is dead. Long live the king. You don't get to do that, you're a doctor! Long live the king! Long live the king! And thus ended Sir Graham's great quest for the lost treasures of Daventry. Despite the loss of their beloved King Edward, the people of Daventry grew happy and prosperous and flourished for many years to come. Definitely need a medical professional for transferring the crown from the dead king to the random can they get <laughs> And whenever King Graham looked into his magic mirror, he saw visions of adventures yet to come for him, for his children, and for Daventry, the land he loved so much. The Yay, lots of people. Don't want your children to go through this. Uh, coming up. Cool. Stevenson, Heitman, Janus, Parton, Foy, Scott, Rettig, Abdul, Cole. 
hood and heart. Well, if you might have heard the alarm that was going off during the uh, ending session there, the stream is coming to an end rather soon. However, once the credits are done, I want to test one more thing. Yeah, I shut off the alarm really quick there during the, uh, the monologue. We have kids beef up security so none of them get kidnapped in the night. Yeah. Well, thank you everybody for being here through all this. It's, uh... It's... An old, old game that... Not sure how much of a crowd I could have drawn with it, but I'm glad we got some new faces in here. Have a good one, Coconut. Get those groceries. Food is good for you. Yeah, the kingdom was kind of going to crap over those uh, treasures, so... Him dying to stress over it... It is reasonable. Didn't we already watch animators? And background artists? Come on. Come on, game. What are you doing? I mean, will you tell me how many points I got? Like... Eh, who cares? We're restarting. Real quick. Because um, I want to try something. Come on, animations, you're slowing me down. I want to try something with the dragon. Because I have an idea that seems very much like this game. Move stone. Take dagger. Okay, now we need to find the well. Yep, time. Time's okay. We're okay on time. It is Wednesday, after all. Now the question is, where is the well? Because the well is near the goat. Where's the goat? There's the well. Okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to climb into the bucket. We're going to exit the bucket. I'm going to go back to regular speed. And now I think we can get that bucket. It'd be easier if the bucket wasn't attached to the rope. Cut rope. Can't cut the rope from there. Climb into bucket. Cut rope. Brilliant! Take bucket. Fill bucket with water. With difficulty, you fill the bucket while swimming. All you have to do is just drag it into the water. What insane man is am I plotting? Dive, dive, dive. So some of you might see where this is going. <laughs> uh, exit water.
throw water at dragon. Good shot. The water hits the dragon square in the face, dousing the dragon's fire. Apparently I put out his pilot light. Whoosh, whoosh, whoosh. Now it's just steam and clouds. Yeah, I think that chest over there is just for it to say, this is not the chest you're looking for. Unable to defend itself with any more than harmless clouds of steam, the dragon rolls aside the granite boulder and sinks, slinks off in shame, leaving the mirror behind. Ha! How can you not defend yourself, Mr. Dragon? You could move that boulder. I am a tiny human. You could have pushed that boulder into me and killed... I was killed by a much smaller boulder. Really? So that was a quick 31 points. <laughs> Yeah, too reliant on its fire indeed. And so that means this way is that random hole in a mountain that we found that one time. Yep, and there we are. I am so glad that worked. <laughs> oh, I love it. But that's all we're gonna be doing in this stream. Uh, next, probably next Wednesday, maybe next Friday, we'll move on to King's Quest 2. I don't know which one King's Quest 2 is. Um, it might be the one where he's looking for a queen. So, yeah, next Wednesday or Friday, because we are doing Wednesday and Friday again next week, uh, because the multiplayer Tuesday is going to be on Monday. So if you like multiplayer games, I have no idea what we're going to be playing, but it'll be Monday night at 8. Probably. Check out the Discord. It'll, uh, it'll show up in the Discord. Now, if you're not on my Discord, uh, I'm sure somebody can get you the link. And it's on all my YouTube videos. It's down in the doobly-doo on uh, Beam and Twitch. It's all sorts of places. But for now, I need to get going and record another Dead Cells episode because that game is really fun. So, I will see you in the next video or live stream of King's Quest 2 or Super Mario Maker or Ultimate Chicken Horse or goodness knows what. Dead Cells in the morning with light.